Today, a little holiday magic hit Hampton Roads. Santa made several special deliveries for boys and girls, 80 children in 10 Hampton Roads cities fighting life-threatening illnesses. Today, got a few minutes to just be kids, and we got to go along for the ride. So let's see what we got, because how many, how many stops did Newport News have? It began with all the precision of a military operation. Oh, you're Hampton. Y'all Hampton? This is Norfolk. We've been working on this since July. Months of donations from the community, all for patients at Edmark Hospice for Children, little kids fighting big illnesses. And what we're doing is we're taking Christmas out to every one of the Edmark kids and families today. The volunteers came from all over, including local fire and police departments. Um, we start getting kids' wish lists and we put them together. They loaded up to the brims. Somebody's going to give me a ticket. Yeah. For all these obstructed views. It's about as full as it can get. And with that, they were off. Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. With Santa himself bringing presents and holiday cheer. Merry Christmas. <laughs> bringing gifts for families like the Wallmans who get help with the care of their son who's fighting cancer. Can I take this to your tree? Sunday's delivery had gifts for every family member. Oh, look at all the people that came to see you. But Ed Mark's help goes far beyond this one day. I think of my Edmark nurses as my girlfriends. You know, they do a lot of stuff like this, and every time when they do something like this for us, it just um, helps for that little bit of time that they're doing that, you know, sort of forget about all the stuff going on and just focus on being normal, let them be normal kids and us be a normal family. Merry Christmas. Good job, Aiden. But just like on Christmas Eve, Santa couldn't stay long. <laughs> The convoy was soon off to the next home. For photojournalist Bill Cole, I'm Deanna LeBlanc. Ten on your side.